Hello all you lovely internet people. How are you? My name is Lasha Snow and I hope you're all well. So, today's video is a reaction to the World of Warcraft uh, Battle for Azeroth cinematic trailer. Full disclosure, it is the Monday morning after BlizzCon. Um, obviously, the reveal of the whole uh, expansion and the trailers and things was on Friday evening. But at that point, I was in the airport heading to London to help my sister and her uh, her boyfriend move back here. So basically, all weekend, I've been driving a van, and I got back here yesterday afternoon. And I had to help go sort out storage, and uh, basically didn't really have any time to watch all the reaction videos from all my favorite YouTubers and things. And I thought, right. If anything, I'll save the cinematic trailer to watch myself and with you guys, and hopefully it's good. Hopefully it's good. Wow, cinematics always are pretty brilliant. Like, So, obviously the new expansion is Battle for Azeroth, and after defeating the Legion, we will try to defeat one another. And as a Horde main, obviously you know which side I'm on. Anyways. Let's stop dallying around and just watch it. Battle for Azeroth. Sinister music. Quality of that. Where's that now? Looks like the Undercity. Is a cycle of hatred. Or Lordaeron. The Undercity to Horde, of course. Alliances forged. And broken. We have paid the price for sharing this world. There's our war chief. And we have forgotten what makes us strong. The graphics on her face. There's Mr. Anduin. Will be ours. Great man. My king. We Holy have shit. That helm. The fluffy Greyman. Keep firing. They're pissing Sylvanas off, and that's not something you really want to do. What the hell is that thing? It's like a big siege engine. This guy looks like Sarfang. Maybe it is because he's given pride of place. Troll hand. She's incredibly badass looking. And in this cinematic, if not a little bit. Hot. That was a hell of an arrow. Jesus wept. Oh, goosebumps. Goosebumps. Holy shit, that guy looks like Volgen. Little ma Mandoin, Andoin. Ooh, that was class. It looks very like Varian though. I suppose that would be the point. What's happening now? Oh yeah, what is um Anduin's a priest? 
a holy like a holy slash disc priest so it would use the light Okay. So he's basically just healed everybody who. all the soldiers who have fallen. And Sylvanas can resurrect everybody that falls. Although, I don't like that, still got goosebumps. Certainly something. Um, wow, that just had me constant goosebumpy. That was a pretty awesome cinematic. But what I find interesting is if Anduin raised everybody who had fell, or I don't know if he had resurrected the dead or not, I don't think he would have, being a priest. But the fact that he can heal fallen soldiers in a big group like that, as well as then Sylvanas being able to raise the dead. It's going to be a hell of a war. But that cinematic was actually class. And what the hell was that whole void banshee thing? Holy shit, that was... That was mind blown. The shriek though gave me ridiculously... Like raised goosebumps and shivers down my spine. It was actually brilliant. But all in all, it looks like it will be... Uh, an interesting expansion that will have both of our factions going against each other and then I would imagine the uh, the void aspect of this expansion will start to creep in because I don't know at the end of uh, at the end of Legion the void became very prominent and like, here it is don't forget it's here and the little whispers from Ilganoth and it's all pointing towards a void expansion which I don't imagine will start to creep in mid-expansion here. So it'll be interesting to see what raids and dungeons and things we have, considering at this point in time there's no end boss. Well, you can't really kind of think that far ahead because it's just this faction and this faction going against each other. Huh. I, I, as I said, I haven't seen anything on this and like the in-depth deep dives or whatever. Uh, maybe the raids will be cities. No, that might be too awkward to do. Like you go raid Iron Forge or whatever, but I suppose they've done that quite recently with uh, Orgrimmar. So so no. there we have it. My reaction to the cinematic trailer for the Battle of Azeroth. Who knows when it will come out though. Um, some of those zones looked pretty interesting on the other videos that I didn't know. I always get excited around uh, expansion launches because it's brand new stuff it's a new story and new visuals and things so it's always interesting personally I get swept up in the hype so I'm massively looking forward to this and there's always kind of a downside to new expansion reveals is that you still have the story to finish in Legion and you're kind of like Ugh. just get it done because I want to keep going to the next one but hopefully the end of Legion will be powerfully interesting. As I was away at the weekend, I thought I will save the cinematic trailer and share it with you guys. So we can all share in the fun. So I hope you've liked it. If you have, don't forget to hit the little like button. If you haven't already, but you're always around the channel, don't forget to hit subscribe. And I guess until next week, my friends, I will see you then. See ya.